The yam is a staple food to the Igbo culture. The number of yams a man successfully grows indicates its wealth and rank within society. Additionally, the cultivation of yams is associated with masculinity. Yam, the king of manscraft. European explorers and traders introduced several food staples to Western Africa, such as beans, cassava, and maize. These foods were introduced to the explorers while on journeys to America. They, in turn, brought foods to Western Africa. Asian seasonings such as pepper, cinnamon, and nutmeg were also brought back and are still used to flavor dishes. Yams tend to be the main source of food, stable enough to support the entire region on this single crop. The yam could be cut, boiled, smoked, barbecued, fried, or grilled. The first yam is always eaten by the eldest tribe member. In the Igbo culture, soups and meats are a very good nutritional meal. They are usually served with a side of yams or jollof rice. As you probably already know, World Jollof Rice Day is August 22nd to celebrate this marvelous, delicious dish. Well, I'll go to the kitchen. All right, these are the ingredients for jollof rice. Diced red onions. Diced tomatoes. Cooking slash olive oil. Gluten-free rice. <laughs> Chicken boulot. <laughs> Salt. Paprika. Garlic powder. Thyme. Chicken. Pepper. Preheat the oven to 350 50 yes. degrees. 350 degrees Fahrenheit. There we go. Mmm. <laughs> Gluten. Mm. I just, I just, I just do it. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. Mm. Yum. <laughs> oh my god. Beautiful. Okay. No, you're good. Oh. A half cup of olive oil. One half cup. Time out. <laughs> One medium Oh, yeah, you're gonna... Oh, should we do it? Not over that. Not over, over that. Over the sink? Over the sink. Okay. Wait, what if we just dip in? That's make <laughs> Okay. Salt. Wait. Salt. Snapchat oh. satisfying. That sound. Oh. Oh my 
my god, that has Okay, a these smell kids are gonna it. like die. Isn't paprika spicy? Wait, wait, let me. <laughs> Paprika's not spicy. It's it not. smells like it. Oh, that's spicy. <laughs> hey, paprika! That's good. <laughs> Alrighty. Well, we can't put that. <laughs> Yummy. Dinner is served. Yeah, I like spike on here. What is this? It's time, time. <laughs> Dan's cat feels like a pillow. Oh my god, he's running away! I know, yeah, I'll point. Mm. It's really slimy, you guys. When I said, Ugh! it's not cutting. That's where you got me. I think it's supposed to cook and then you cut it. Yeah. That's how chicken works. Yeah, you're supposed to. Yeah. That's how chicken works. So I shove it in. No, 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 no. no, no. Cook, cook it on the stove. Cook it on the stove. Wait, but then on the one, would it be overcooked if we cook it with the rice in it? No. So no, have, you, you can't put. Separate. Oh yeah, we can't put you can't that put in. Raw chicken. Yeah, yeah, we need to cook that chicken. chicken. Yeah, no, we, we don't want to cook it. What did we? What did we? So, so we cooked we're, it we're and the chicken cut it. Yeah. <laughs> and action. <laughs> the chicken guy. This looks really good. <laughs> Wait, maybe it's because we didn't add all those other powders. Wow. Oh! Do you just want to break cover. Adding the cover. <laughs> we have landed. The eagle has landed in its nest. It has. Muscles. Hey, yo, Dan. Wait, no, not the brown thing. I'm pretty sure. Like, just stick the. I think. Wait, should we ask your mom? No, but the brown, the brown thing's a baking pan, guys. No, but I, I don't. It, it is a baking pan. Oh, it is? Oh, it is? I thought that was one. It's like from the As Seen on TV. Okay, redo. Oh, oh the Betty Crocker. There you go. Betty Crocker. Ta da. Good job. How many minutes? An hour. Yeah, for about an hour. hour. So it's 410. Right we'll now. see you back at 510. It is a sign of disrespect for guests to refuse 
food. So basically, you have to eat our jollof rice. <laughs> the eldest man eats first when food is shared at home. In Igbo culture, women are to be considered the masters of the kitchen. Good Yam is a very important part of Igbo food. A man that owns a certain number of yams can be called a DG. Harvesting in the Igbo culture is a very intensive labor where the whole community may partake. And it's hot. Ta da! Oh, well done. Well done. Scrumptious. Are we allowed to? Nope. Jo Let it sit for 10 minutes. Jo Lop rice. Jo Lop rice. Jo okay. Thanks, Thanks for, for watching. watching. <laughs> Enjoy, Enjoy the Joel off rice. rice.